welcome to bitunet code channel uh, guys in today's session we'll see how we can do route filtering in ospf with the help of standard acl and distribute list so you can see that uh, we have ip addresses configured as uh, uh, 12 between 1 and 2 uh, router and uh, 23 between 2 and 3 router and ospf area 0 uh, between r1 and r2 and ospf area 1 is uh, between r2 and r3 so the goal of our today's session is to stop the routing updates of, of these 10.1.1 uh, uh, network to reach R3, right? Uh, let's take the uh, console session and uh, let me show you the show, uh, OSPF configuration that is already present. Okay, so you can see that router OSPF process is running and uh, all the routes are present this is the show ip route uh, command output right so let me show on r2 also so here also we have all the routes present show run section ospf so here also uh, ospf is process is running router id 2.2 and let's go on r3 and here also show run section ospf all the routes are available on uh, all the three routers and we have end to end connectivity we have all the routes uh, uh, in area 1 in R3 so now the motive of our uh, uh, today's uh, session is to block these routes from coming into routing table of R3 so we will do that with the help of ACL we can create that ACL on R2 or on R3 so let's create that on R3. Config tree T uh, access list. We will create access list uh, 10. Deny. What we want to deny? We want to deny address to match 10.1.1.0. We want to deny a whole network or we can deny a specific host or whole network. So whole network will be 10.1.1 okay so uh, wildcard mask will be 0 .0 0.0.0.255 right enter access list 10 now we want to permit specify packets to permit any rest all we want to permit do show access list okay so this is the access list we have created now we have to apply this access list somewhere so we can uh, uh, we will have to apply this on in uh, incoming interface of r3 so let's go to router ospf3 process uh, we will use distribute list distribute list ip access list number it, it will be 10 okay now we have to decide uh, what is the uh, flow of uh, traffic so it will be incoming interface filter incoming routing updates so incoming routing updates for 10.1.1 network should be filtered so let's write here in okay a uh, further uh, not required so we can enter here write show ip access list this is the access list show IP route okay now we can see that we do not have any route starting with 10.1.1 because that has been filtered by uh, IP access list and distribute list okay so if we try to ping from here 10.1.1.1 it will not go through okay so, uh, from here also we won't be able to ping but if i uh, ping from here from r to 10.1.1.1 from here i am successful because uh, till r2 uh, routes are reaching for 10.1.1 network but uh, till r3 they are blocked by uh, access list okay if i use uh, 
uh, it will be successful and 3.1 will be successful so guys this was a short video on how we can do route filtering on uh, ospf with the help of standard acls if you like the video please uh, click on like button and subscribe to the channel thank you for watching this video